Right, going on everyone, uh, welcome back to Anfield Agenda, I'm not sure if you can hear me, I'm pretty sure you can, but uh, we have just lost to Leicester, 1-0, uh, Adam Ola Luchman came on and done the business, I don't really know how to even conclude that performance, to be honest, it was just from start to finish, very stale, very stale, and I just even can't pop the hens out. You think you can keep up with Manchester City with that type of performance and not build a certain momentum? I think that's a problem for many, many reasons. And, you know, you can blame Salah for the penalty that he missed, but when you look at the chance that Mane missed, that's the one for me where I've really got to sit back and say, that's not good enough. And I've been a big defender of Mane. I'm someone who come out and admit that wholeheartedly and that's what I think for good reason I think what he brings to the all-round game usually isn't too bad but I think him Salah over the past few games they haven't been turning up they're heading off to AFCON soon it's looking like we'll do better off without them so I just it's very confusing to think how we're going to be able to come back regain the six points bear in mind we've already played Chelsea and Manchester City at our home ground and they just look very strong like Chelsea are dropping points but if you can keep up with City you're in the title race and right now we're already losing that grasp and we're not even in the new year so that's a big problem Brendan Rodgers is on the screen now but swat I just know what yeah I don't even mind Brendan Rodgers I'm just devastated we lost this game today how you can go out there in the league cup get the win get the win with kids that'd be unreal but and that was unreal. That was like one of the best nights of the season. But then to come here in the Premier League, the one where I'm not saying I would have rather won tonight because we are in a semi final of the League Cup. But like, you still got to be able to beat these sides. Like, that's now Tottenham where we drop points, Leicester, City, Chelsea. A lot of the so called big six, big seven, we're dropping those points. And that's where it's becoming an issue. So we'll see where it improves and we'll see where we can get the points. And um, that being said, I don't even know where I can like conclude it. Who was the worst player? You know, like Matic done sound, Trent done sound, a few other players. But in the main, like, you can't really be going at anyone specific. I think it was just a team effort. And Leicester weren't even that good. Schmeichel obviously made a lot of good saves. Looked like a dad reincarnated, but you can't, you know, Jota's got to take chances better. Mane as well. Like, that's why you can blame the manager on the substitutions, but you can't blame the manager on the chances that we missed. That's where the big issue comes along for me. So let me know who your man of the match was. If I had to say a man of the match for Liverpool, it'd be massive for me. Uh, Trent's got a shout. Otherwise, everyone was just disappointing. Even Van Dijk in some moments. Went. He just went doing what I know Van Dijk can do, and that's where you can't blame just the manager. You've got to blame the players. So, like I said, let me know who your man of the match was. Smash a like on this video, comment and all that other business. We have just lost to Leicester. And also, let me know if you think we're still in the title race, man, because I'm still in two minds. I'm not too sure. Uh, the Champions League, maybe League Cup and stuff, but in the, in the main, you can't really just go with anyone, can you? So... We'll see and we'll hope for the best anyway. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all later. Peace.